Always a special day on the calendar. Champions League final day, and it's a privilege to be bringing the game to you. My name's Derek Ray, joined for commentary by Lee Dixon. The atmosphere is building to fever pitch just minutes away from kickoff time. It is Manchester City taking on Chelsea. Well, hundreds of millions of people will be tuning into this one. Probably the biggest club game in the world. Pointed end of the tournament. Who's going to come out on top? Well, Derek, we're just about to find out. Very, very excited. It is the game that the world truly focuses on. The Champions League final. Only two teams left in the quest for European glory. Who's it going to be tonight, Lee? Well, it's a toss of a coin for me. It's a really big night for everybody. All that hard work leading up to pre-season training, going through your domestic league, playing Champions League on and off, the winter break, all of that culminates in tonight. Very, very big night for everybody concerned, supporters, but most so the players. They have to stay focused, play the game, not the occasion. Straightforward piece of goalkeeping. What do you think we can expect to see from the visitors tactically, Lee? Well, I think we'll sit everybody behind the ball, out of possession, trying to hit the team on the break. Makes sense to me, to be honest with you, but you need to be very disciplined in your defending throughout the team if you're going to carry that plan out. Alexander Zinchenko. Ruben Diaz. Gabriel Jesus. It's very attractive attacking football, and Mares comes into things now. And possession given away. High pressing at its best. Very good reading of the game to win possession back. Gundogan, and return to Gabriel Jesus. Rodri. And it's Gabriel Jesus. Conte. Jorginho. Werner with it now. And Golo Conte. Free kick to Chelsea. Werner, what a shocking pass, really. De Bruyne. Gabriel Jesus now. Rodri. Let's just clarify the injury situation. Our man on the side of the pitch is Jeff Shreves. Feeling down here is that he twisted his knee when turning testing out ever since but at the moment is carrying on cheers Jeff could be a chance to break here oh and a perfect ball now how about this Conte well that pass easy on the eye and mistimed the run sadly that's offside And a throw-in for Manchester City, it'll be. Joao Cancelo. Well, they must exercise caution standing off as they are. Well, City controlling possession. But that doesn't lead to goals necessarily. They haven't created enough. Too slow up front, midfield, very average. The coach, he's not happy at all. He wants more from this team. Well, not great defending. De Bruyne really getting stuck in and they successfully got past him given away by City good strength to keep the ball 
Now can they counter clinically? Can they keep it going? Chilwell. Now Conte. Now the attack promising as it was. Scuppered there. Well, adding up all the stoppages, we will have two extra minutes. De Bruyne. It's with Gundogan. Gabriel Jesus. And that signals the end of a tight, tense first half. We're still waiting, Lee, for someone or something to kickstart this Champions League final. Mm, not the best, is it? I'm thinking about my half-time cup of tea and my refreshments and my vegetarian pie, to be honest with you. Into the second half, then, in this battle for Champions League glory. Pulisic. Here's Chilwell. Thiago Silva. On to Werner. N'Golo Conte. Can they get in behind them? Well, he's been ruled offside. Ruben Diaz. Gabriel Jesus now. De Bruyne. Alert defending. N'Golo Conte. This might be ideal for the counter. Good physical play. Rhys James. It is now with Jorginho. Not an especially strong challenge. And they had a bit of work to do in getting to that through ball, the goalkeeper. And Manchester City will go to their bench. Half an hour remaining then. Well, what can they do to stop him running at them? Bernardo Silva. Phil Foden now. Well, offside by the merest of margins. Unable to keep the ball. Mares. Fernandinho with it. Precise ball movement. Well, the attack looks promising. Bernardo Silva. And here's Fernandinho. And that puts them in position. Oh, he saved it well. Set pieces can be so important. Let's see what City have been working on. And firing it into the area. The high press was on, and that's a fantastic tackle. Such an important goalkeeping intervention under pressure. And Bernardo Silva has it. Aguero. 
That is top-notch goalkeeping. He had to reach in with his hand. Yeah, it's all about reading the pace of the ball and the player's feet. When do I go down? When do I strip the ball? Did a brilliant job then. Aguero. De Bruyne. Mares! Opportunity missed. Jorginho. Here's Chilwell. Still level, but Chelsea on the attack near the end. Jorginho. Now will they be able to play it in behind the defence? And winning it back. Fernandinho and five minutes to go Fernandinho with it giving the ball away making use of his physical strength to hang on to it can they grab the lead late on Mares. No danger here as he runs at them. And options in the centre. Joao Cancelo. Pure ball control. A good and fair challenge. Well, that's it for the 90 minutes, but this is not... Understandable that fatigue might set in. A strength-sapping night for all concerned as the first period of extra time begins. Bernardo Silva. Fernandinho with it. De Bruyne. Fernandinho. De Bruyne. Aguero. Bernardo Silva. Well, it didn't worry the keeper. Well, Derek, you can sense the frustration growing from the fans. That leads on to the players being frustrated too. You can sense it. Can they get the goal? And unable to keep the ball. Over the touchline for a throw in. Alexander Zinchenko. Aguero. And cleared away. Time for a change then. Excellent vision. That's all they can conjure for now. Half time in extra time and stick. Well, the drama continues to unfold. Second period of extra time now. Mateo Kovacic. Rudiger. And Havertz. Given away by Chelsea. Well read to put an end to that attack. Pressing their opponents. And the ball back with City now. All even, but will it stay that way? Aguero. 
Well timed tackle. Now, counter attacking possibilities here. Can they keep it going? Ziesch. Aguero. Bernardo Silva. Here's Mares. Fernandinho. Well, sitting deep like this might be a dangerous game. Well, that's not textbook defending. And return to Aguero. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. After 120 minutes, they cannot be separated. And so, in this Champions League final... And so the penalty shootout about to commence and as a play. And the penalty converted here. Well, that's hours of practice, Derek. Hours of practice. And he's taken the low road. Beautifully done. Well, he picked a corner, head down. Good penalty. Well, that was the so-called Panenka, but when it doesn't work out, oh dear. Well, he's got all the goal to aim at, and he choose... He might be wishing that hadn't been his plan of attack. Well, he's tried to be too cute. Just strike it, lad. Well, he's gone for finesse, and it's really paid off. Oh, my word. Look at the technique on that. Goalkeeper beaten from the spot. Bread and butter, Derek. Bread and butter. A Panenka penalty and a brilliant goal. Oh, I'd run away from the goalkeeper now if I were you. A moment he dearly wishes he could have back. Well, I thought he was in, and he did too, but no. And now he knows what's on the line. If he scores, they win. Well, the chips were down, but he couldn't keep his chip down. Well, when he goes in, it looks brilliant. Now he just looks silly. And he scores! Well, don't they look easy when they go in? And it's gone in! Well, the sweet sound of the ball hitting the net. You want a pressure cooker? This is it. He... And now it is truly final! One team in raptures, the other disconsolate. What an ending. Well, you can talk about the merits of penalty shootouts to decide big tournaments, big games. So much nerves of steel are needed. A little bit of a gamble here and there. Who's going to come out on top? But the end result is there for all to see. What a night. Well, they're not going to forget this in a hurry. A proud moment. For the losers, that's a case of trying to forget about everything that has just occurred. Well, oh, just the point, Derek, always be respectful of the losers. Yes, you're in raptures, you're celebrating with your mates. Always took time to go to the opposition and say, unlucky. The party has started. It's going to be quite the night of celebration here.